sans changer le lieu de procès encore une fois. Ouh. La sécurité est tellement stricte que même en personne au tribunal ne le sait pas. Il soupçonne un tournant pour le pire. Pierre, dis-le à tout le monde. Maintenant plus que jamais, continuez à implorer le ciel. Évidemment. Dans deux semaines. Oui. Deux semaines. Merci. Mr. Mahran, you may go in now. I hope you'll understand. Unfortunately, this was planned over six months ago. How long would you be gone? Three and a half weeks. The person we select for this position needs to be on board as soon as possible. What about shortening the trip? I haven't seen my parents in over two years. I can't disappoint them. I realize this is not the best timing. Hey, wife. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, I'm proud of you. You must have made some impression for them to be willing to wait for a month. Well, they say they have plenty of applicants who can speak Russian or French, but only three with both. So naturally, they picked the cutest. <laughs> yeah, I'll think about investing some of that big money you're going to make. Sure. Why don't you give my dad a call and get back from your trip? You figured out how you're going to tell your parents? About the job? Everything. Not yet. I'm praying for you. Samir, I know you love your family, and I understand you want time with them to build this bridge. It's important. But I just wish there was some safer way. Look, I know we haven't been friends that long, and maybe it's not my place, but I'm afraid. Promise me you'll be careful.
Uh, you see, even then I was the handsome one. I was afraid you weren't really coming back. What makes you say that? You must have met some good friends over there. You'll never grow up, will you? Come on. No one can replace a friend like you. Who wants to grow up, anyway? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, good night Mother. My baby. about this Christian pastor who's on trial. The newspapers in America were talking about it. No mention of it here. Yeah, Christians are always getting themselves into trouble. Who pays attention? Lunch for the price of tea. Not bad. What are you doing? You made a mistake. It's the will of Allah. We discovered the mistake. It's the will of Allah, we correct it. Like a 
snake behind my back? The years of work, the sleepless nights. You repay me with this? For what? A Bible corrupted by madmen? Superstition that mocks Allah by worshiping the prophet Jesus as a god? Look at me! Look at me! No! 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 These are the delusions of Satan! Stupid! Ignorant people are brainwashed into believing these lies! Not my son! This is a nightmare. I'll handle him. No! Don't hurt him! Please! Don't hurt him! My brother may not have the stomach to do what's necessary, but do not underestimate me, or even your most distant cousin. You repent. You will hold the Quran and say the Chadar. You will beg Allah for forgiveness. If not, we will send you behind the sun. Why do you want us to suffer? I would give my life for you. Then why don't you do as your father tells you? I cannot renounce my faith. Just say the words. What you believe, keep it in your heart. Who will know? God will know. I've always hated the midday sun. Such an ugly light. Never a speck of shame in this family. Not a single speck. And just like that. You are a stranger to me. An enemy. <laughs> I gave life to my only enemy. Empty your pockets. Empty your pockets. As of this moment, you have no father, no mother, no sisters, no home. You are dead to me. You will leave this house. You will never again use the name Maharan. I cut you from my life like a cancer. swine in here. Come on. Get out. Get out. Get out! Come here! How dare you pull up my shop? Don't you ever come near this place again.
any idea of the penalties for sheltering a deserter of Islam? I've nowhere else to go. I sympathize with your predicament, but the laws are quite clear. I am sorry. I understand. That's a new approach. The secret police are getting more creative these days. Young man, if you're hungry, I can give you something to eat. This might be hard to understand. Might be. There was so much all at once. I wanted this first week to just enjoy being with them again. That's why I never told them I was going back. They think you're here for good? Yes. So they know nothing about the plane ticket. Good. That's good. You don't have to do this. When have I ever passed up the chance for a little excitement? Still crazy, huh? You're the crazy one, putting yourself through all of this. Samir, how could it be worth the price? For what it's take, no price is too high. I know, I know. The London Times, Washington Post, the Moon, they have all written about, as they call it, the secret trial of Brother Hughes. The Islamic Council is not happy. Is there a secret trial? If there is not an immediate end to these reports, I'll be forced to take measures I prefer not to. How can I give you such assurances? I'm not a newspaper man. Samuel, in the last month, another church in the north was shut down. For painting the sanctuary. Without a permit. This is not an anarchy. Three more Christians angered the wrong people and got themselves killed. 
Who knows how many of you we had to imprison? Don't you people ever learn anything? Someone, I have good reason to believe that you are leaking the information out of the country. It sickens me to imagine the consequences, if I am right. I have no personal interest in seeing anything happen to you. Do I convey my meaning? I value any protection you can give me. Don't do anything stupid. We'll be watching every move you and your associates make. I'm not a spy. I don't work for the secret police. I realize how careful you have to Young be. Young man, I'm not going to discuss this any further. But I... If you'll excuse me, I have work to do. My friend, beautiful morning. Yes, beautiful. Would you have some coffee with me? You are too busy. Exactly. This must be corrected. Come. If you're blind, you think living on the streets will bring him to his senses? You know my son better than I. I have seen this before. He's been twisted. This will not work. I know that. Just don't believe this. I do something very, very bad. Please leave me alone. If he's not back in another day, I'm not waiting. We'll find him. And then what? He'll submit. Come on. He was just here. Kamal, we need you. Get out of the country right away. This month has got everyone worked up. They're looking for you. Do they suspect I'm living? I don't think so. But if they find you, it will not matter. They will never let you go. They will do whatever it takes to break you. You shouldn't be in the middle of this. Samir, we both grew up with Islam. Maybe I believe. Maybe I don't. I mean, just don't get yourself killed. Get out as soon as you can. Nothing for eight weeks. There isn't a single seat. They have only two flights a week. They are always overbooked. No, that's... I need to talk to someone. There has to be something. You are already talking. 
talking to someone, and I'm telling you, nothing can be done. Please, I have to get on an earlier flight. Impossible. Impossible. Pastor Samuel, it is out of desperation that I write this letter. I understand your caution because I'm my full name is Samir Salem Mahram. I was born and raised in this city. As a young Muslim boy, I was taught honor, respect, and obedience. My father, being a stern man, expected that my teenage years were like those of most. I neglected my studies and lived to play soccer. My religion was mostly ritual, based on fear. I never questioned the belief of my family. The time came to become serious about my future, so I learned to apply myself. And four years ago, I earned a scholarship to study international business in Chicago. In addition to my other courses, I studied French and Russian, but my English was not yet fluent. In my first semester, I was failing horribly. The shame and dishonor I would bring upon my family terrified me. Guilt and despair gave rise to persistent thoughts of suicide. Then, I met two students who took me into their study group. They were so kind and compassionate, helping me to catch up. And soon, they began to talk about God. One brought me home to visit his family. I'd never seen such love and concern for a foreigner. I began asking questions. I was confused. Islam had taught me that God could not have a son, that Jesus was only a prophet, that the Bible was a false book, and that Christians were immoral blasphemers. But I read the Bible each day, praying that the truth would become clear. My sin jumped out at me. I saw my need for a savior. And that night, for the first time, I spoke to God as my heavenly father. Since then, I've grown to know my Lord. I belong to a strong church. I work with young people. I'm starting a new career. And I just began seeing a wonderful Christian girl. I was making this visit to show love to my parents and if possible, to share my faith. I knew something of the risks, but never how dangerous it could actually be. Pastor Samuel, there is no more to tell. I have no shelter, no food, no money. I am alone. My father has disowned me. 
my uncle and my cousins are after me for my life. I can only pray that your heart will see the truth of my words and that in his name you will come to my help. You are my only hope. Exhausted. I have a place underneath the church where you can sleep in safety. Welcome. Welcome, my brother. week from Thursday. Can you get to Pierre? Too risky. in your letter to me that you speak French. Yes. Couramment. Est-ce que couramment? Le français faisait partie de mes études. Pourquoi? Samir, for several years we've been smuggling teaching materials for Muslims into the country. At the same time, we send information out. Information the government tries to suppress. We rely heavily on prayer and help from the church outside and keeping them informed is vital to us. Now, I've just gotten word that the pastor, one of my dearest friends, is to be executed in 10 days. Brother Yusuf? You know about Brother Yusuf? I read some news reports in America. There were very few details. He was convicted of teaching converts. Samir, I look for God's purpose in everything. I do not believe that your coming here was a coincidence. What I'm about to ask, you have every right to refuse. You really are crazy. Well.
when have I ever passed up the chance for a little excitement? What is he doing? Vous avez besoin d'aide Oui. Il y a ma voiture qui ne démarre pas. Vous avez vérifié le Delco Avez-vous été envoyé par Samuel J'ai des nouvelles de Frère Youssef. When word of the secretly imposed sentence was finally confirmed Monday, church leaders from around the world joined together in an unprecedented effort to influence the court to reverse itself. Father, it is you who open prison doors and who set the captives free. Now we pray that you will set Brother Yusuf free, that you will deliver him from the bondage. Our heart out now, Brother Yusuf, by bidding you on San Leven to spot it. hermano Yusuf, salve tu cuerpo de la muerte, y le traiga de vuelta. Seigneur, il n'a rien fait qui vaille une sentence aussi cruelle. Frère Youssef est pour moi un exemple. Oh, Brother Youssef, où est ce bonheur Où est-ce que tu es là Brother Youssef, le chair de Jaïa, tu es là. Tu es là, 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 tu es là. Our Heavenly Father, remember your servant in this dark hour. By your will, Father, save his life. Restore to us the body of Christ, Brother Youssef whose work in your name is so far from finished.
your time here has been too brief. You'll always be in my prayers. And you in mine. You have many gifts, Samir. A keen mind, tenacity, courage. The makings of a pester. If only you could be duplicated. <laughs> I know you'll be very successful. I hope I have the wisdom to know what that means. Spokesman said that today's kidnapping of Khalil Awad in the port city of El Saad was carried out in retaliation for the recent release of Brother Yusuf, the subject of a major international human rights campaign. A quickly issued communique itemized a new set of guidelines for dealing with, as the declaration puts it, the continuing Christian threat in the region. Any delay in the official government... After all I went through to get that ticket, now you don't use it. Don't worry, I'll use it. You better get back. <laughs> 